NMN is back in a big way here on YouTube. And I say here on YouTube because really starting a couple days ago, I started again to create content specifically for YouTube and not other platforms because I began to see some data. At first it was about TMG. That's what led the pack. That's what popped out. Suddenly YouTube started showing a couple videos I'd made about TMG out of nowhere. And I mean, bigger than they've ever been boosted. So content began to get pushed out. And when I looked at the data even more over the past couple days, I've seen a bunch of videos about Edaman getting traffic, getting pushed out for the first time in two years. I'm going to talk more about this channel being back. If that's indeed the case, I'll make a bigger announcement about that, but I want to have the data to back it up. And that's what I've been monitoring, the analytics, the YouTube analytics. But I'm going to share with you that screenshot and and I want you to look at it and probably some of these videos you've never heard of and didn't see because the content wasn't being pushed out previously. Some of these videos uh, were published in 2022 when I really first started creating content in earnest. So it's as if the algorithm is going back and reviewing content that it hadn't been showing and playing some YouTube catch up and showing it more than it's been shown in over a year, really two years time since this content was even shown in any regularity. I'll also show you some of the graphs of what I'm talking about where these videos just over the past few days started to spike out of nowhere on YouTube. So it's great to see NMN getting its attention again here on YouTube. It's exciting for me, it's exciting for the community. I'm sure the last video I posted is almost 40 comments, 2000 views, which is about 10 times what I got on the last few videos that were really the reason I decided to just almost give up on YouTube and just post content that I'd created for other platforms because I just wasn't seeing the reach at all. We weren't even reaching our regular viewers. We certainly weren't reaching anyone new. Now I'm going to ask you for some help. I've never do that, but please try to watch this video to the end. I've got some good content here for you. I've got some notes here that I think you're going to like hearing about, but I need you to try and watch to the end so we can get this video out there so we can get the watch time up. What you can also do is is subscribe. I know many of you have subscribed in the past, but you can unsubscribe and subscribe again and then click the notification bell if you haven't already. I never ask for that stuff. People who have watched this channel for years know that it's not my style. I don't really beg for subscribers. It happens organically. And at least until a couple of years ago, it was going very well without having to ask for it. But right now, as we're kind of in this reset mode, trying to trigger uh, YouTube to show even more, especially the newer content, I need your help with that a little bit. Also comment, especially if you've never commented before, and not just for the algorithm, but because I genuinely want to hear from people. That's what I've missed the most. I went from hundreds of comments per video to about, some of them had less than 10. Some of it was spam. So it wasn't even anecdotes. It wasn't even real life stories anymore. I'd certainly gotten a few, and there were a lot of people using the code, the pulse. I got more on that in a minute, but not a lot of traffic and not a lot of comments. So I really want to hear from you. If you're suddenly being shown content. This is something that I've been getting told about. Hey, I'm suddenly seeing your videos again after months and months of not seeing them. Let me know that. That's how I first found out that the shadow ban had some reality to it, that it wasn't just my paranoia, that it was an actual real thing that was going on. So to break out of that is great. Of course, like the video. The video that has 2,000 views has 200 likes from a couple days ago, the TMG video, which is crazy because I haven't had that many likes in a video in a long time other than some promoted videos, but you have to promote it to hundreds of thousands of people to reach a few hundred. So it was, it never made any sense and it killed watch time and it killed click-through rates. Right now, no videos are being promoted and I hope to never have to do that again. And certainly share, you know, this video with people. And by the way, you could click on the polls below this video and watch some other content while you're here. Play some catch-up, uh, YouTube catch-up, if you will. To update you on me, a lot of people used to check in as I would check in on others who were taking in a man just kind of, how does he look? How does he look? How is he doing? How does he sound? Uh, what's his attitude? What's he say? You know, uh, now it's been almost four years since I've taken NMN. I feel better than I have. Even in my heyday of the channel, I feel better now. Uh, you know, I'll let others decide how I'm looking, but I did turn 60 years old just a few months ago, about three months ago, and I don't feel it. And I don't, 
think I look it. People tend to be surprised when I say, yeah, I'm 60 and, you know, I have a YouTube channel. And they're like, what channel is that? What do you talk about? Tell me more. Um, so my update is I'm doing better than ever. And a lot of the content you probably missed over the last couple of years was me talking about that and really how I've been doing. I kept going, even though the audience wasn't there. I remember doing a couple of live videos where almost no, there were like two people watching, three people. I mean, don't get on YouTube's bad side because it's not a good thing if you're a channel creator at all. But I would talk, I'd stay there and just talk to the people and that content is still up so you can go look it up and see what we were talking about uh, but there weren't a lot of people there because uh, it just wasn't happening I plan to do some live videos again to see if we can get some more engagement that'll be interesting to see uh, I want to thank do not age do not age has done a lot for this channel and also done a lot for the NMN community by keeping prices down by joining the effort to protect NMN in the US even though they're not a US based company they still join Natural Products Association and helped fight the legal battles to win. And I think the breakout of this channel is testimony to the fact that we are winning and that our efforts were not futile, that they had merit and that it was worth fighting the fight, even though it was two years of just decline, you know, and being in YouTube jail or whatever. So yes, it's great to be back, I guess. Thank you, <laughs> YouTube, for the unban or whatever's going on and showing content again. But Do Not Age has stuck with me the entire time. They treated me the same when I had 300,000 views and they treated me the same when I had 30,000 views. They never went they took care of customers. There were 8,000 people that used the code, the Pulse. Now you can just type in Pulse and save the 10%. Uh, they took care of them all. So people were still coming back and remembering where to get their NMN and the code to use, even though they weren't watching the content in most cases, which is crazy. But again, a big shout out to them. I still take 17 of their products. I take their supplements and I've never stopped. And I attribute that plan, that protocol, that multi-pronged approach approach to wellness, I attribute my success to that. I attribute my health success. So even though the success of the channel wasn't there, I've been successful. I've been healthy. And uh, of course, now I'm upbeat and I find it fun and exciting to think, oh man, this, this video is actually going to reach some people again. So yes, this is all evidence that we've been winning the fight. It's taken a while, but we've turned a big corner and man, we're back and it feels good. David Seclair has been very quiet. That's another signal that we're doing something right, that things are going well. They haven't been boasting about any progress in making NMN a drug, an exclusive drug. And I do believe that's in the best interest of the consumer. I really believe it's in the best interest of people's health or self-care to have access to NMN and other products and not have to get a prescription from their doctor. I just don't think for a natural ingredient that that was ever the right way to do it. And I'm glad we fought the fight, even though we paid a price for that fight. I'm really glad that we went through it. So going forward, and I appreciate you sticking with me to the end like I asked, but going forward, the content plan is, again, more new videos. I'll announce a bigger comeback statement uh, in an upcoming video if the data and the analytics keep supporting uh, that that's what's indeed happening. But I do intend right now, uh, going forward, to post more new videos and more variety of content. This is something people have asked about for a long time, and I get it. I understand it. I do feel like NMN was worth fighting for, and the focus on NMN and defending NMN was important. But I hear your calls for me to talk about other content. Maybe you've taken NMN and you're happy with it, but you want to hear about other things you can be doing. And a lot of my content the last couple of years was variety, was about other things. But again, it wasn't getting pushed out either. And my belief is because this channel is so NMN centric that none of the content was getting pushed out, unfortunately. So I'm going to rework and repost some of that content, some of the stuff you missed with some new commentary. Uh, I'll edit it down to the most concise stuff so you won't be seeing uh, redundancy. It'll be reworked if you happen to have seen it before, but most of you didn't. So I'm excited also to go back over the past videos. I've probably 150 videos over the past couple of years that really didn't get pushed out. They'd have an initial spike in views from YouTube, but they'd never get pushed out down the road. Uh, so it'll be interesting 
interesting to see how that works to post some of that content. But a lot of it's going to be new and fresh content and keeping you guys up to speed with what's going on now. Thanks for watching this. Watch the video. I think it's going to be here. <laughs> watch the video here uh, and watch some more of the content. Do some binge. You know, take some time and do some binge watching of the polls. And I'll talk to you again real soon.